explosive. Explosive. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I agree. I agree. <laughs> Amazing. Hi, Rob. Hi, Luna. Thank you, thank you so much for your time. A pleasure to be talking to you both. So I'm going to start with you, Rob. Is is your character, <laughs> Steve Parker, is going to accomplish everything that he wants by the end of season two? Oh, my gosh. That's, <laughs> that's a good question. Um, well, um, one would hope so. I, I think, um, you know, hopefully there's a cheerleading squad rooting for Steve to to get what he's after but I don't, I don't know you know like sport you don't know who's gonna actually come out on top yeah you never know right we need to watch oh. it. <laughs> i'm gonna try though amazing luna you've been playing amazing characters and voicing Rio morales which i love her so much and now you have detective angela burgos what was about her that got your attention to be part of this day this this amazing project well mostly having seen the the show before the season before which i i just thought was wonderful you know and, and as an actor you just want great stuff great writing great actors and this show has all of it uh so when i spoke to adam rapp and dan futterman and they told me what they had in mind for the character i i just found her so intriguing that I I wanted to, you know, play with all of them. And of course, you know, working with uh with Jeff Daniels and Warren Tierney, that's that's huge. Really big. Yes, it is. And then and then Rob, you have this dynamic also with Luna's character. How did you guys create that like on set? I you know it's we we meet for the first time you know in in the scene and it's it's the one scene we have it's it's um it's really you know it, it it's it's kind of where you you just meet it where you're at um like i'm i'm familiar with luna and and her work and and i've always really been excited about um everything she does so that with me at playing steve meeting the character it's it's pretty great when 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 you get to to meet someone for the first time in a scene yeah yes <laughs> Luna. And found it really fascinating these two characters meeting so late in the mm -hmm. in the season and they both have there's so much going on for both of them centered around this one character del harris and just that whole meeting is pretty brilliant yeah, there is a lot, like the, the, the show, there is a lot of questions on season one that didn't get answers. And I hope everybody get the answers right now. But what was like the, the, the biggest challenge, you know what I mean? Like, because it was pretty much almost three years since season one. What was like the biggest challenge to like to bring back this story, uh, Rob? You know, uh, when I went because because there was a good amount of time um with all that was happening in the world um when i when i got back to pittsburgh it was crazy when i landed at the airport and as i was driving to the housing i started having all this deja vu of like oh wow because i yeah, i'd forgotten oh. so much and then so that I, i had that sort of experience going back to to the old town um this this fictitious town of Buell, um, and, and and I, I enjoy that. I, I think that's, you know, it's almost like a dream state of like, oh yeah, this this is familiar to me. Yeah, that's amazing. And Luna, if Detective Angela had to say a word for me about season two, what would she would say to me? <laughs> One word about season two. explosive explosive yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I agree i agree <laughs> amazing i just want to thank you so much for your time rob and luna luna muchas gracias and I a lot of success you. 
and <laughs> I hope everybody love it. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Thank you so much. Ciao, ciao. ciao. If you like to support or continue to support Journal Camera, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share the videos.